upon lecturing a male friend about the danger of gender roles while simultaneously texting another man about my boobs. <laughs> Sometimes feminism is wonderfully obvious. By woman made. Boycott Rush Limbaugh. Girl cunt beard. <laughs> feminism doesn't tell me what to do about this bar full of hipsters. I lust hard after men in glasses and skinny jeans. <laughs> Did I just objectify an entire room full of men? Yeah. And if so, does that bring us closer to equality? <laughs> hey, is that a glass ceiling in your pants? Because I can see myself pounding against it for the next 35 years. <laughs> Is your father a mechanic? Where did you get such a finely tuned sense of personal boundaries? <laughs> if looks could kill, you'd be lucky House Republicans blocked the Violence Against Women Act. <laughs> All of the small talk, approved topics of conversation. The Chicago Blackhawks, the failure of charter schools, unionization efforts at Target, obscure craft beers, and how this place used to be so much cooler before all the kids from the yuppie neighborhood started coming here. <laughs> Avoid my body, his body, what I'd like to do to his body, and anything that has ever been written in Cosmo by now we need another trip to the bar. <laughs> hey, women, own seven, women earn 77 cents for every dollar earned by a man. Can I buy you three quarters of a drink? <laughs> How about a Long Island ice? <laughs> back up, back up. I'm supposed to be sex positive, like I show up in bed with pom poms and motivational cat posters. Two, four, six, eight, oral sex is really great. All the orgasms, none of the shame. Too bad pop culture never got the message. Victoria's Secret is still selling thongs that say sure thing, and Steubenville is still blaming the victim. How do I say sex without saying object? How do I say I want your attention without saying I am yours for the taking? Oh. That's a nice shirt. It would look great on my floor after we've both given enthusiastic consent. <laughs> if I said you had a nice body, would you hold it at exactly the distance you feel comfortable with? <laughs> <laughs> Are you pro-choice? Yes. Let's go do things that lead to abortion. <laughs> Woo! Now for the clothes. Do I want to leave with him? Does he want to leave with me? His place or mine? Exactly how much of these of us had to drink divided by our weights and rates of metabolism? Is it gender neutral that neither one of us is carrying a condom? Uh, Susan B. Anthony, am I letting you down? <laughs> or do you just wish you'd been allowed to have this much fun? Hey. I need you, like a fish needs a bicycle. 